Hey Men's Health, my name is Manny Jacinto. I am here with Carl Flores, my trainer, and we are gonna go through our workout today. I think the reason why I started working out was when I was younger, it was because of girls, I think. And then uh, as you get older, it doesn't last because uh, there's gotta be something more that motivates you to get you into the, into the gym. For me, that's been just needing to feel comfortable and strong in my body when I do day-to-day -day things, like lifting things at home or like just playing sports. Like I feel like it's it's super important to just maintain that that higher level of activity as you get older because uh, we can get really complacent with our bodies. Exercise can become a secondary or something that's that's not as important as we as we get older. So yeah, I try and work out at least four or five days a week, get in some good rest times, like whether it be in the sauna or in a cold plunge. Um, but working with Carl, I've really learned to put my body in different and weird positions so that, um, yeah, when I'm reaching for something in the top drawer, I don't get a cramp, um, which is weird to say, but it happens. I basically exercise to be able to reach the top drawer. That's, that's basically the reason why I'm doing all this painful activities. So this particular exercise is actually called the world's greatest stretch, uh, rightfully so, because it stretches pretty much everything from the inside of your thighs, you get thoracic spine rotation and a little bit of hip flexor activation through his left side. And it's nice because once you're in that seated position, you're opening up your hips and we're gonna do a lot of hip movement today. So it's really prepping the body and activating the right muscle groups to make sure that he's ready to go. Carl and I actually come from a dance background so, and the reason why I started working with Carl is because he understands and has a base and a foundation um, in dance um, so that we can still incorporate strength training exercises, but still have the mobility and flexibility um, for other roles or other characters that we take on. So up next, what I'm gonna have Manny do is a side to side medicine ball skater and pretty much what he's going to do is he's going to jump side to side uh, loading one leg at a time and as you can see the ball is loading on the outside so when he jumps that ball comes with him and it forces him to feel and distribute that weight evenly so he knows how to accept the load on the knee that is bent it's good for preparation for dance also strengthening and creating stability in the knee so what we're having manny do right now is called a lateral beast crawl with a band uh, when you resist movement, when someone's traveling in, a, in this plane, the lateral plane, you're getting them used to the ground, you're getting a lot of sensory feedback through the, the hands and the toes, which comes in handy when you do things like breakdancing, contemporary floor work. A lot of those things translate into the athletic performance abilities and it can help them become better at the craft. This exercise right here is called a kettlebell snatch to a windmill. One of the reasons I like this exercise in particular because it is an expression of power right into a challenge for the shoulder to create stability through this motion right here and a good stretch for your hips, hamstrings, and glute activation. So there's a lot of stuff going on and one of the reasons I like it so much is because it's one of the few exercises that challenges all of those things at once. Just like dance, um, there are a lot of complex demands of the sport, and so we have to find exercises that do a good job of challenging all of those attributes in one movement. So this exercise is a half kneeling lateral toss. One of the reasons I like this so much is because it challenges the front foot, as you can see. There's a lot of stability that is required uh, in addition to tossing, and there's an expression of power on top of that. So when you think of dance and quick movements, you have to do things that challenge that to better prepare you for the sports. Like this. One more. Hasa. So the next exercise that we're gonna have Manny do is called a bridge hold chest press. One of the reasons I like this uh, a lot better than your average bench dumbbell press is because your body acts as the bench. It strengthens a lot of muscles on the back side of your body, like your glutes, your hamstrings, your, the back of your shoulders and upper back as you're holding your body to perform that chest press upon. So it's other layers of the puzzle that are a little more difficult to complete. As we wrap up the workout, we're gonna finish off some core work and then conditioning in that order. What Manny's got going on right now, he's holding a side plank, 
but we're adding a twist to it, literally. He's having his right arm twist underneath to get a little bit of thoracic spine rotation. In addition, we're having his obliques go to work, his hip flexors are having to hold him up, and he's having to provide a lot of stability through that shoulder. So if you zoom up close, you can really see his shoulders like shaking a little bit, fighting for that stability, but that's exactly what we want. What we usually do to finish off Manny's workouts is finish off with some form of conditioning after the core work. He's gonna be on this bike for a total of six minutes, 30 seconds at a quick pace and 30 seconds at a slow pace. We got some Kleenex here because we gotta release those demons before and during and after maybe. So we always keep a Kleenex box close by just in case. Don't want the demons. We don't want the demons. All right. All right, Manny. So I got you on my clock here. Nasal breathing starts now, and here we go. Let's start with a quick pace, quick pace, quick pace. Good, here we go, here we go. Mm -hmm. We're up nice and tall, up nice and tall. There you go. Good, 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 good. Perfect. Good. Mm -hmm. On my watch, final 10 seconds. Going quick, quick, quick. Calming down in three, two and one. Let's calm it down. Still going though, still going. Slow pace, still through the nose. All right, thanks Men's Health for tuning in. Uh, please catch I Want You Back on Amazon Prime. Uh, please stay strong, stay healthy, and hopefully see you guys soon.